that's when I let my dreams take over. And I said, you know what? I think I'm going to, he said, you're going to leave, aren't you? I said, yeah, I think I'm going to leave. I had done 25 years in PR, right. strategic communication. Mm -hmm. And that's something that I knew that I could always do. That's what I turned to in graduate school to make the money that I said I wanted to make. You took a chance years. on you. Yes. 25 years later, I had the credentials. I had the credibility. I had the, all those C's that we were talking about mm -hmm. to actually do what I wanted to do. So ultimately, that mentoring platform that I had morphed into executive coaching because I went and got training to become that. And reflecting on what I saw in the Fortune 500 when it came to women and also women of color, mm -hmm. how that middle of the, the leadership pipeline was just gushing right. women, spewing us out. And Black women were leading the way followed by Latinx and, and Asian and white right. women too. The, and, the ceiling was, wasn't was even there because right. it, you couldn't see the ceiling. Right. It was so high you can't see it. 